in the second half of this video I'm going to be doing some test footage with the different filters. In the comments, let me know which one you like the best. like one that can nice to have this little case because then I can put the extra one in here I just protect it if it falls in the water or something. And I think this, yeah, this is the instruction manual. I think I'll use YouTube for that part of it. And on to the big case. for bringing the accessories and stuff along. You got the float. So when you're carrying the camera over the water, this will keep it from sinking. If you drop it. And this is probably for your head. I think this is a head mount one. Yeah, it's one you can put on your head so you can for your forehead. And, oh, this is the suction cup one. This is this will be nice. It's for if you want to put it in the windshield of the car or something to do time lapse or driving somewhere. Just use this to mount it. And got the memory memory card. Got that separate. Stuck some of the stuff in here. This is gonna be nice. This I've been wanting one of these. I was always jerry rigging my mount. This way I can. This is one that's your chest mount. It's got the 
straps and everything so that you can wear the camera a lot easier without it. Because I was always worried that it was going to fall down and it would fall in the river wherever I'm at. And we've got a, this is nice, and another small one of these. The other small one I've got for my camera, it uh, broke on me legs because the way the legs are they're it's just like a wire and that broke so I was needing another one of these so that's good and we got the selfie stick this will be really nice because if I get a trout on the camera can go underwater so I can extend this down while I'm fighting fish and maybe catch you know a few of them underwater as I'm fighting them and we got another felt bag right here. Sure what's in here. Oh, this has got all of her attachments. This is a got double sided tape attachments so you can make mounts in different places. Um, not really sure what this is. It's spongy. Oh, we'll figure that out. Oh, this is good. This is a handlebar. Looks like a handlebar attachment point. Like if I want to use it while I'm on a bike ride or whatever. Oh, this is this is good. This has got the screw, so it converts to this kind of connector that's in the camera. That's good. And then another one with the clip, and just a strap of some kind. And a second one, which is good. And uh, another another one of the ones with the screw. Other, I think these pads are for when you have to keep it from fogging up when you go underwater with it. That's what I think those are. It's got like a shorter base. I think that's what the difference is between these. Yeah, let's see what else we got. We got a. Oh, this is good. This is a tool for tightening. Tightening these. Oh, that's good. Okay. Well, that's all the stuff, and I'll get some the camera open ready and we can do some test footage at the end of this video. So, okay.
so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please remember to hit that subscribe button if you have not done so and the bell icon so you know when the next video comes out. Also, please comment down below what you thought. I really appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day and I will talk to you in the comments.